This demonstration illustrates how the ChemTrack LCA3 performs automatic titrations to determine chemical treatment dosages, in this case with aluminum sulfate and caustic soda, for a high color, low alkalinity raw water sample. During the setup, initial chemical doses to be added to the sample prior to the titration can be programmed, as well as a target pH, which is generally the same as the plant's coagulation pH. For this example, the target pH is 6.3 and there are no initial chemical doses. Once the automatic titration process begins, the charge and pH values are displayed, along with the amounts of alum and caustic that have been fed into the sample. A timer displays the titration elapsed time, and a signal health reading is meant to indicate any potential issues with the charge measurement. As a 1% aluminum sulfate solution is added to the water, the charge reading moves towards zero. The pH is subsequently suppressed due to the acidic properties of this coagulant and the limited buffering capability of the low alkalinity water. As the pH drops below the 6.3 target, the unit begins adding a 0.5% caustic soda solution to gradually raise the pH. The LCA continues the addition of both alum and caustic until a neutral charge value is attained at the target pH. Upon completion of the test, the parts per million dosage results are displayed for both chemicals. In order to establish confidence in the LCA results, it is recommended to periodically perform jar tests to verify the amount of chemical feed that's necessary to reach optimum reduction of turbidity in organics. It is quite possible that the treatment goals will be met with doses that do not quite attain full charge neutralization. In these cases, correlations can be established between the LCA results and the actual dosages that are required to meet the plant's target turbidity and organics reduction. With an accurate measurement of charge neutralization, the LCA3 provides an affordable and efficient way for water treatment plants to quickly determine an optimum dosage for their coagulant as well as for any additives used for pH adjustment in the coagulation process.